gonna be? She doesn't, her Kim Kardashian's far is better than her. <laughs> oh my God, I'm gonna die. Okay, um, either way, I don't think you're going home next week. No. That's <gasps> what I'm thinking. Everyone no, no, thinks no, no. next That's week. That's what I'm thinking. I'm gonna go Adam. No, I'm thinking if Arlie wins, he might put up Chuck, Chucky's bride and you, and tell you to use your thing. No. No fucking Yes, way. they want you to use it. They I, want you to use I it. I know they want me to use it, but... I, but that's what Arlie might do. No, no. I'll tell Arlie straight up. I'll do something crazy. <laughs> I'll do something. Motherfucker. Motherfucker. I don't get crazy on those guys. <laughs> I wouldn't be here for when you get crazy when you start following people around the coast and their HOH to it. I can't wait. Listen. All those ninjas are going to, like, bum rush me when I get up in this bitch. Listen. Um, if Arlie wins, I'm telling you, he might put up you and he might put up Heather because he wants you to make that move mm -hmm. to take out... To take out... I'm going to tell him straight up, you put me up, I'm going to take out John. Because the whole time he's been spitting to John, that fucking hit, we got to get out Andrew and Kenny. We got to get out Andrew and Kenny if we want to win this game. They're way closer together, blah, blah, blah. But what he doesn't realize, these two guys are guaranteed to be homeboys. But now that this guy injured himself, and this guy heard what they were talking about him, and he told him back, he's kind of iffy now if Kenny's really his boy. Mm -hmm. So, if he tells me he's going to put me up, or for every fucking reason or whatever, well, I'm just going to strictly put him up. But the thing is, if Sarah wins, I have really no one to threaten her with, except I'm going to put up Kenny. But then, I don't think... Uh, I think I think what's gonna happen next week if, if anybody wins, like the Arlie or the John or whatever, they're gonna put up you and the Creepzilla because they're gonna want you to use your thing. Oh fucking no! Oh my. Adele, okay, but okay, so, I know what you mean. Realistically, if we were in this position, strategically, it's a smart move because yeah. then the bud's on your hands, not on ours. And I know what I have. But to they use. might be thinking that. But you don't have to. <laughs> Fucking broke ass, ripping like you got <laughs> fucking millions of dollars. You got nothing. <laughs> you, don't have, you don't have shit to use. I gotta win H O H. If you win H O H, it's gonna be so cheesy. I have to leave if we don't want to get H O H. You fucking like gonna hold on with it. You're like, ah. <laughs> before you fucking win it. That's a camera. I can't wait. If I win H O H, everyone's gonna jaws and go like this. <laughs> I'm gonna put up this fucker, right? <laughs> And uh, oh, I wish I'd done that. My I'm gonna put him up in Zena. Oh, okay. oh, Zena. You know why? Because if I put him up in Zena and Andrew wins, who is Andrew gonna take off, Zena or, or, or Kenny? Kenny. You think so? Mm hmm. No. Nah. That's his money in the bank right there. But, nah, man, I don't know. Listen, man, they're making out. They're, they're, they're thinking they're like ready to get married. Oh, God. Love is stronger than, than romance. He don't love her. I know, but in the game, he'd be loving up on her. Oh, goodness. Anyways, this is what I'm thinking. Because she could beat any boy in any competition, too. You better believe that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's, or, just, she's like a boy. Yeah. So they give another boy in the fucking house. Yeah, pretty much. But she's, she's cool, though. You know, like, whatever. But, like, look, if it, them two go up, and somehow, even if I win veto and I take her off, mm -hmm. then all I do is put up John right next to Kenny. Everyone's yeah. keeping John. Kenny's going home. Yeah. Kenny's going home. If Kenny goes home, everything shatters because Kenny's the brain of this girl, of this guy, whatever. So if Kenny goes home, now her connection in this game is her, Kenny, and Arlie. Now if he goes home, all she has is Arlie left and then she had to get back friends with Sabrina. Did you know that they were coming after me? I swear on the Quran, I had no clue. Because oh, if I knew, I would Are you crazy? How oh, the fuck sucks. would I know? Fucking rat face bitch over here knew. It sucks. This girl had a good plan up her sleeve. She knew what she was doing all along. Yeah, I give her a, props, man. She, knew. she was gonna friggin' uh, blow my plan up. <laughs> blow it up like friggin'. Oh. When it wasn't 5 5, I was like, oh fuck, we're fucked. Fucked. But like, I was like, I was like, goodbye, Paul. If you're seeing this, it means I'm coming out right after you. I did. Goodbye, Paul. <laughs> you know what? If for some reason, well, say like, uh, it seems like you're fucked, right? That seems will be. Like, really? <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> this guy was my best buddy. He went out first. And then I chilled with this schmuck and schmucked around. We were, uh, uh, if Heather chose with you, she's going out next. <laughs> Whoever chose with you is going out next. It's not they chose with me. It's the Adele curse. It's not that they chose with me. I go chill with them. Like, it's like... And then a, you curse them. <laughs> What's in there? Like, what the fuck? You're freaking You're cursing people. Uh, you know what? I think I should just cook a nice meal. I mean, you sit down, eat a nice meal, wake yeah. all these motherfuckers. I'm still getting punished. <laughs> Listen, you speak for your damn self. I can't handle slop. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, you know what, for the next three days, like, you're on slap. You know what would be so fucking cool? Like, say I snap on you, and I'm like, and I'm on slop, and I say I'm going to eat slop, and they, instead of punishing, like, the whole house, they make me eat normal food, and everyone else eats slop, so everyone gets oh. so bitter of me, oh, like, God. cooking burgers up and shit like that. I'm going to miss this house, though. Yeah? Like, well, if you weren't in it, it'd be hard because I don't, I barely don't like, I don't like these people. I don't like Sabrina. Mm -hmm. I can't stand Rochelle. I can't stand Rochelle because she's Sabrina's pet. She's Neda, just I'm a okay. kid. She's so naive. She doesn't know what she's doing. I think Neda I'm okay with. Yeah, I like Neda. I uh, like everyone. I like, uh, even Chucky's right. I'm okay with Chucky's right. Yeah. Arlie's okay as well. Um, John I like as well. You know what it is with Kenny? I never connected with him. I never clicked with him. So I don't really care for Kenny. Mm -hmm. Zena came in here and blew up the fucking game. I don't go back to whatever dark hole you crawled on, <laughs> Zena. Like, what the fuck? That was the craziest twist when Zena came in. Zena fucked it up. Then, um, <laughs> Andrew, I don't think I'll be friends. I don't like Andrew. You know why Zena fucked it up? Because she got a vote on us. Oh, yeah. She, that's how Zena yeah. fucked it up. If Zena wasn't here, if Zena wasn't here, that would have been tied. I know that. It would have been tied. I know that, because she would have jumped ship. But we didn't need but her anyway. Exactly. You yeah. would have been the time. I would have been the tiebreaker. Um, friggin' Andrew. I don't mind I don't, Andrew. I don't like him. I don't like his personality. I think he's kind of offensive, and I don't like how he harps on Paul's shit. Like, let it go. Um, Adele, eh, hey, all right. <laughs> yeah, all right. <laughs> yeah, all right. <laughs> um, fuck, I got a sick picture uh, now that I think and of look it. Fuck, oh, fucking Sabrina. You know what I know of all this? You have a good heart, but you don't care. What you think about his damn heart? I don't give a fuck whatever comes out of her mouth. I would love to be the one to... If I could go back, I probably would have gotten into an alliance with you and leave it at that. <laughs> Not Paul, because Paul is just... Paul's a snitch. Yo, Paul's a snitch, yo. Paul yo, will get Paul, you... you'd be snitching anyway, Paul but we still love you, man. Paul will get you arrested. <laughs> Yo, if yeah. Paul, if you did something with Paul <laughs> and the cops fell onto him, yo, I'm gonna jail. You're, You're gonna, gonna jail. jail. Your mama's gonna, gonna jail. jail. Your sister's gonna jail. My kids are gonna jail. We're all gonna jail. <laughs> <laughs> Kevin Paul. Kyle, I tell you why I didn't like Kyle. I think he talked too much. Yeah. He went around like, like he talked to me trying to get information out of me, and I'm just like, yeah, no, there's no girls thing going on. The girls thing was going on from like, I think like week two ish. Mm. But it was never strong, you know, clearly. You know what? Even in all the seasons, everything, the girl alliance never worked. Why? What fooled me? Yo, what kind of Tom fool me fooled in my head to go join on damn girl alliance? But I think, I think when I came in here, though, the guys automatically bonded together. So it was kind of hard to not go into a girl's thing. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm trying to say? And I feel like... Um, you know what? I wasn't even knocking and they let me in. I, yeah, I'm saying they just all grabbed together. Yeah. And then they threw you guys on, and then you guys were the misfits. <laughs> you. We were the outsiders. The, the outsiders. Misfits. When in real life do you see yourself hanging out with a 43 year old dad, motivational snitch? <laughs> <laughs> Fucking this jabroni over here. <laughs> mm. I know. Mm. <laughs> when? I was trying to convince this jabroni to throw down on this jabroni. <laughs> Get them both <laughs> yeah, you know what? I don't want I don't want Kyle to lead, to be honest. Mm. I'd prefer if Paul went over Kyle because Kyle could compete. He, yeah, he, he would compete still. And he's not a snitch. Like, like, oh my god, man. I thought Paul was gonna review my card. <laughs> oh, he told Sarah mm. that I was gonna keep him safe. <laughs> and that's what she keeps saying. That that um he told her when I wouldn't confess to her that I did, she didn't trust me even more. No. But I think what they did was like, 
things that I said, they just went back and told the girls, like, oh, I just said this, I just said that about you, this, this, and that, like, you know what I mean? You think Heather would, uh, if I try to go with her, she'll snitch me out? Yeah. Why? Because that's, because Heather goes around telling everybody that she loves them, they're her best friend, and that she, um, she loves them, they're her best friend, um, she also will never put them up. She told that to me, to Sabrina. She told, she told that to Netta. So you can't trust that. And then she also told me things. Yo, listen, what I was doing, <laughs> when I thought Heather was leaving the next day, I was like, shit, I can't stand Sabrina. Yo, that bitch is too much. I know, I know. Because so. so, 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 so. I thought she was leaving anyway. So what do I care if she's that information? I don't know. Bitch, stay. <laughs> <laughs> you got smashed. We made so many minor mistakes this whole game. Right? Little mistakes, little mistakes. Yeah, getting in the room with the wrong people is a mistake. Like, I really think this fool has my back. Who? Arlie. You're done. What, who, what, what do you want me to do? Okay, if you stay here, the only... Okay, can, can, can I just tell you? Mm -hmm. Tell me anything. I need it. Because I need someone's real point of when view, you're, right? When you're here, right, the only problem is these, you're going to be disposable at some point to these people because they already had their real connection. Mm -hmm. Where me and you, we got into a bond when I was HOH type thing. Mm -hmm. And for some reason, I don't know why, but I trusted you more than those girls. Um, I didn't tell those girls a single thing about you. I know. I that. didn't tell those girls a single thing about your card or whatever. I didn't do like I, I know had that. your back. But with those motherfuckers, I was like, hmm, I don't like Rochelle to Sabrina. Sabrina, I don't like. I, I, you know what I mean? Because like, because I generally didn't like them. Yeah. Type thing. But with you, I didn't do it. So I knew that like I felt some kind of loyalty. I'm like, I'm like I feel loyalty to this guy, and I genuinely like you as a person too. So, I honestly would have wrote it out with you. You think this guy's gonna put me up? Make I me think, use the card? I think he might do it for you to use the card. And I think that's what I'm thinking. Who else is he gonna put up? He already promised me he'd never put me up. He promised Nana he would have never put up. And I think he promised that to Sabrina and Rochelle right now. Who else is he, if he wins, he's putting up Heather and who? He's not putting up Kenny. He's not putting up John. He's not putting up, maybe he's, Z he not putting up Zena because he doesn't piss Andrew off. Or maybe he might put up Zena like what Rochelle did. So maybe Heather and Zena again. That'd be sick. Like, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. The crappy part is, it seemed like it was kind of in the works. They were always going to backdoor me. I don't think they were always If Rochelle had won veto, they Nothing. would have told her to use it and she would have used it on me. You think so? Mm-hmm. Because she's doing exactly what they want. If if Rochelle wants to blow up the game, she could put Andrew up and he'd go home. Oh, he'd go home for sure. Over uh, with Heather. He'd put oh, yeah. Andrew up, Andrew would go home over Heather. But she said, I just want to get blood on her hands. Police? And everybody wants me out, so. I, I don't see how everyone wants you out. They do. I know, but like, I, but I realistically, game-wise, I don't see it. I know, why, one, one friggin' age. Why H -H? one girl when there's fucking all these beasts? Though? Because it's... Like, uh, no offense, she's a player. She's like a... But she's in with them, and they think I'm coming after them. What are you gonna... That's why. They know I'm coming after them. And the move I made with Paul, trying to keep Paul here, made it very apparent. And also, Sarah knew a lot of inside information, and she probably wouldn't have told them mm. all, everything. Everything. About. So they know I'm coming after them. And they think I could win things. Because mm -hmm. as she says, she's not kidding me in case I win veto. What's so funny is they're not telling Andrew yet that I want, want him out, even though I'm playing that game. You know what I mean? Yeah. Because they want to keep me so I can make the move, right? I even tried to tell Andrew, like, oh, I'm not coming after you today. I, and when, when I kept Paul, Paul was coming after you. You know, he was going after Kenny. Like, it wasn't you. It wasn't you. Because I knew I was going home, so I was trying to... To, to play whatever I could play and see whatever lies I could tell to get them of to course. switch. Of course. Oh, no, it's good. I'm good to go home and see my freaking kids. I'm not gonna watch the show for a while though. 
that's traumatizing. Personally, <laughs> I would never watch a show that's after. That's traumatizing. Because I feel like I go home and watch, but like they always bring people back to ask them, like, oh, what happened? Like, what did you see? What did you see? I don't want to go home and watch. <laughs> I don't want to go home and Trust fucking me, watch. I don't either. I don't think a Nick's watching. A Nick's traumatized. A Nick's for crystal balls. A Nick's for crystal balls crying, talking about, what have I done? <laughs> This is fucked. But did I tell you I felt it though? Did I, you feel it? I only felt it after the next morning when Heather came in that night and was like, Ika's fighting with us. I was like, fuck. And then she's like, Sabrina's fighting with Ika. Michelle's fighting with Sabrina. And now they're fighting with each other. And then I was like, oh fuck. Out of all the people drunk that could have fought, you were the last three we needed to fight. But can I just tell you, even if I didn't really fight with them, this would have still happened. You think so? Yes. Because what's after Sarah did what she did, they would have went up there on Rochelle's HOH and they would have convinced her to do it. do it. And she'd have done it. I can't wait to blind side blind side every one of these fucking idiots <laughs> that think I'm gonna put up Andrew and when I put up fucking the thing is Kenny went into each and takes himself off the block. Then all I have to say is like, guys, it was very simple. I had to put up the two couples to break up the fucking showmance, right? Andrew's pretty set in this game. He has Sabrina, who's in love with him. Yeah. He has Zena, who's in love with him. Okay. And he has connections here. So that's a lot of votes for Andrew. Like he has people, he's set up kind of good. Kenny has Sarah. He also has Rochelle, and he has John. So those players are set up pretty and has, well. And he has Andrew. Yeah. And he has the new girl. No, but like her loyalty is more to him. I'm trying to show his loyalty. His loyalty is there and there. That's, yeah. No. His loyalty is there and there. And he also has Rochelle. So one, two, three for Kenny. And for him, one, two, down here. And he has Kenny's loyalty as well for now. Um, it's a strong alliance. And they, and what That's they did. That's why I'm telling you, I have no chance. And they brought in people mm -hmm. as well. But you're safe for next week. You might end up in jury, which sucks. I don't think I will. You know what? Even like next week, I'd rather not win HOH if it's a double eviction, right? Yeah. But the thing is, I can't risk it again. I gotta try to win. Yeah, I could have held on a lot longer in that other game. But you wouldn't have outlasted Rochelle and so. I wouldn't have outlasted them. And I seen that only one person went out. Mm -hmm. And I had the feeling there's no way I was gonna outlast like a, any, like, yeah. like at least four I could have won that competition. Cause I'm little, I'm so I, little I know and I'm strong. I, Mumsy should have won that, you know that, eh? But if she wanna, I would have been up and walk anyway. Who does she want out? She wants me out too. Okay, b besides you. She wants whoever Kenny wants out. Say she wins a choice, who is she gonna put up? I think she'll put up uh, Nada and Rochelle. Nada, Nada and Heather, or uh, Heather and the new girl. Yeah, they're, gonna, they're gonna take off these girls. Maybe even Sabrina, because Sabrina's annoying as shit. Everyone wants Sabrina out. I have to take out Kenny. If I take out Kenny, it everything sucks. falls apart. I, th I think what sucks is like every single week has gone the way he wanted him and him wanted to go on. Every, every single week. I know. The first week, the second week, the third week, and now this week. I know. It just, if I'd known that, it just sucks that Sarah did that because if Paul was here, it'd been such a different game. But when she did that, it fucked me in the game. Because they knew that I was coming after them at that point. They knew. But then when Rochelle won, I felt safe for a week, at least. That was just kicking the nuts. And like that's why, like, when I was telling you, that plan kiss your ass not going to work. Because oh, I had felt to try. it. I know, but still. Who wants to leave this game without even trying, you know? I know. I really wish I'd used my HOH and at least put up those two guys and went with a bang. How can you get the host punished? <clears throat> mm. 
you know what it is? I'm not going to do that because I don't want to upset, like, production. It's kind of like a slap in the face of them, too, you know? It's disrespectful, you know what I'm trying to say? Yeah, yeah, yeah. If I do that, it's, like, disrespectful to them. To get the house punished? Yeah, because, like, you're doing things that you're not supposed to do. Like, like you're on slap and you're eating type thing, mm -hmm. stuff like that. Like, they don't like stuff like that. Okay, it's okay. disrespectful. You know what I mean? I mean, Arlie thought it would be a funny, funny idea to one day wake up late at night, make a couple burgers, eat them real fast, and get the whole house punished. You're so funny. You're evil. <laughs> yeah, cold water, like, cold shower for a whole week. That's what I can't believe. That fucker and this donkey got everyone cold showers for two fucking weeks, and no one even cares about it. I know. You know what, though? At least I'm prepared to leave, unlike a lot of the people who left here. Mm -hmm. A cow was also prepared to leave. Oh, yeah. You know why? Because it was the back door. You can't fight for it. You can't. It, that's the worst way to go. It's exactly. It sucks. You know, I see why people are so like that. Uh, Better, yeah, right? Because the back door going out that way sucks. But you know what? We don't want anyone to, like, YouTube us and us cutting people up and stuff like that. You know what I mean? We'll get a bad image. We're not even bad people at all, no, but we just don't. Not a bad person, but yeah, but people can make us look bad, right? I know. And now we've got the whole world watching. We really gotta watch. I know. I'm kind of scared to go out. No, see no. How, I think like when I got that letter from Brendan, when he was like, "Don't listen to what people say," like, brush it off. I'm like, I kind of feel like people are talking bad about me. No, no, I don't think so. no. But this jealous donkey. Oh, he's he's already that. using that old oh, Canada or like shoe, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, I yeah. I can't believe that, man. What the fuck did I do? I won one fucking thing. I know, I'm and happy And then this fucker, too. Arlie, he even mentioned it in the room to me, too. Oh. He's like, oh, straight up one so you think they want to kick you up before a jury? Oh, yeah. They have to. Ken doesn't like any of them. <laughs> <laughs> no. I don't think, I don't think they're like Andrew. Andrew's annoying as All shit. All I know is if some fucking reason no one tries anything fucked up or shady with me, right? Mm -hmm. And I, uh, and say I don't win HOH and I still get to stay, that means I could win the next HOH and really make a move, right? I know. It just sucks that you do it alone. Oh, I know. I try to cry in front of Rashawn. I'm like, oh, please don't do shit. If you're my friend. The minute I saw that it wasn't budging, all the tears went away. <laughs> how does he cry so easily, this guy? Don't say anything mean, but how the fuck? Like, I guess Arlie was like, oh, you're a bully or something like that. You know his mission? Arlie said things that were true, though. Oh, you know what Arlie said? What did he say about you? Oh, my God. What did he say? He didn't have the balls to say something to me. <laughs> Honest to God, you know what he said to me? I, uh, I went to the room to get my shit, like my towel and yeah. stuff. He's like, Adele, last night you were so fucking annoying, I couldn't sleep. And I thought of it and I was like, motherfucker, I fell asleep before you, I didn't even talk to you. <laughs> <laughs> right? So uh, I was like, yeah, whatever, motherfucker. And I just grabbed my stuff and I was walking out the door. And when I pulled the door to walk out, he's like, no, 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 sit down, sit down. I need some advice, I need you to talk to me. <laughs> <laughs> and then like, He's like, and then here, and then in, like here in front of everyone, he's like, straight up. Adele did it like a boss. He didn't even care. He just walked away from me, and I had to call him back in the room. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Everything I do is going against me, even when I'm just being normal. Even when you're just fuck. being normal. I gotta put trust into this little bimbo. I, I, I think you did. Like, your social game is way better. Like, my social game fucking sucks. Oh, like, yeah. Your social game. It's, it's not it thing. sucks, it's just you're a sister, you know what I mean? Yeah. And when you want to talk, you're going to fucking talk. When you want someone to listen, you're going to make sure they're listening. <laughs> Motherfuckers want to play? You play. <laughs> <laughs> you ever don't ask me anything with my freaking goodbye message? Of curious. course not. No, don't be, of course not, because I know who mm. you are. <laughs> Poor Paul, they're, they're like, uh, make a silly one. I was like, Paul, you might be dancing your way out of the house right now. See you on the outside, my brother. <laughs> Mm. Fuck.
I just thought that everything is going the way they want it. They've controlled every single HOA. The only thing they're not going to be able to control, if Big John wins HOH, who the fuck is he going to put up? Next week? Yeah. You don't think he'll put you up and try to tell you, oh, use your thing, use your thing. Yo, I'm telling you, Adele. <laughs> Adele looks confused. I'll Adele. tell him, buddy, I'm putting up Kenny. <laughs> Oh, okay, yeah, and see. Yo, shit maybe is Maybe he'd like that. I don't give a fuck. I'm gonna tell him this, I'm gonna put Kenny or Arlie. They and they might be like, it might be like, yo, Adele, I'm gonna put you up so you can use your thing, so you can use your thing. No, no. So you can use your th yo, you're saying no, but nah, that's what... Nah, motherfucker, nah. <laughs> <laughs> that's um, what they're gonna do. No, it doesn't matter. I'm gonna tell him straight up, that's not how I'm gonna but use Adele, my car. That's, that's not... <laughs> They're going to say, that is the last week to use your car. It's the last week to yeah. use your car. So I'm going to tell them, put up anyone else. And if someone wins veto or they get themselves off the block, I'll then, be like, good job, so but you're going back up. And then really, when... So, so basically, what you want to happen is to not have them put you up at all. And then at the veto ceremony, when they're like, like you want to make them believe that you'll use it at the veto ceremony. <laughs> you're just going to I'm going to go like this. <laughs> That's my only, that's my only defense mechanism. And then one day, down the line, or then the next competition, say like I'm on the block or whatever, and like it's like, oh, you're against fucking Heather, Neda, uh, Sarah, Rochelle, and Kenny. And he's like, sure, Kenny, go sit down. <laughs> Bring up Sabrina's fucking ass. And it's gonna be me versus all the girls. You know, it's gonna be you against the world in here. Like everybody who you could trust is gone. I'm, you're the, you're the I'll play. tell you. Who. Okay, this is what you do. When I leave here, you attach yourself to Kenny or Andrew. No, <laughs> because I'd rather yeah. go down like and a. I'm not even going down like no, no sucker. No, what I'm saying is, if you befriend them, like when you befriended Paul and Paul left, you befriended Kyle. And Kyle left, he befriended me. I'm <laughs> not leaving. When you befriend, when you befriend fucking Andrew, he's leaving too. I need to befriend the, Andrew. No, it's the fucking prayer that your mom left you. <laughs> <laughs> <coughs> uh, no, you know what? This what? is what's gonna happen. I'll tell you my whole plan right now. Okay. What's your plan? Because your spot ideas never work. <laughs> like, what the hell am I going home right now? Because <laughs> you tried to save this motherfucker. <laughs> I know. You had a veto and you could have just pulled his ass off. Who cares? Who cares? Don't pick up the You didn't even tell me to do that. I didn't really think that. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just do a shot of alcohol and drink it. No, no, no. I, I, I can't drink. Get drink. <laughs> I can't yo, drink. Yo, can I just tell you when you was going crazy in here? Mm. One night, yo, I walked down. There's a couple nights. It was yesterday. John, I saw John in the slop bucket. In the kitchen. Cleaning the slop bucket. I looked at the cameras. I'm like, I figured it out. He's the wall. I swear to God. This guy's the fucking wall. I was Baby like, blue I was like, like, holy shit. I'm like, big brother, you're fucking with me. <laughs> I'm like, what are you doing? He's like, I'm just cleaning the slop. I'm like, you're not on slop. He's like, yeah, but if, if I don't do it, they don't eat. He walked in the pantry. I'm like, you guys, I can't figure it out. <laughs> Crazy ass. <laughs> Crazy ass. Like, I don't know what you're doing. I know what you're doing. I'm like, where's your mic? He goes, should I go get a blanket and you lay under your, your thing and I'll bury you? I fucked you. <laughs> and Brent, she's coming home. No, you know what? Honestly, you know what? Um, mm -hmm. If I had to leave, I'd prefer to leave before jury. You know what? It's me and you. Yeah. And I I'm think, coming right soon. I promise. No, you're not you. coming soon. I don't want. I don't want you to press. I want you to stay in here and, and cause shit and up. Fight your little muscle mass off. <laughs> what did you cause all this dust and shit? <laughs> Give me an asthma.